Hey y'all, it's one day to moving day. I'm feeling pretty chaotic. I'm gonna pick up Venice from San Francisco airport. She's coming all the way out from New York to help me move, which is really, really nice of her. It's almost the perfect airport pickup, but I pulled something idiotic. I timed this out so we would pull up at the terminal exactly 17 minutes after their flight is supposed to land. <laughs> I tell you, it's a thing of beauty. I cannot express to you the feeling I get from a perfect pickup. So, yep. Hello? Are you in the red car? It is the red oh. car! Oh my god! <laughs> How much am I feeling like I want to pay for gas today? A lot? More than a lot? Or extremely a lot? What do you think? Should we just pay a lot? I think so too. Here is a quick uh, summary of everything that's happened so far. We woke up, had a nice garlicky breakfast, got Starbucks. They upgraded me to a venti pumpkin spice latte for free. Don't know why, but I'm not mad about it. Venice and I both cried. <laughs> and we're just talking about stuff. And now we're at McDonald's. That's everything that's happened today. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what would you rate the cleanliness of that bathroom? Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> okay, let me ask you another question. Are you a toilet seat cover person, yes or no? No, I hover. You hover? Yeah, I like do this little... Oh, the Aguilita. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. I'm a hoverer. I'm a hover. But not a coverer. Not a cover. Good to know. <laughs> I feel like I know you so much better. <laughs> <laughs> as of yet. That one got a hole in it. Yay! And Venice is taking a much deserved snack break. What you eating there? My... She thinks that's the best part of like trail mix. Comment below. What's the best part of no of Gardetto's. Oh of Gardetto's mix? Like mix. No. Pub mix? Pub sure. Sure. Yeah. Move in day. Move in day. But it's not over yet, because what do we have left to do? We still have to bed stuff. go to Home Depot, buy some tools, because we're going to go get a bed that I found on, actually, my mommy found it on Craigslist. I don't know why I like to say Craigslist like that. Craigslist? I like to say Craigslist. <laughs> yeah, so I have to get some tools and then go and disassemble the bed. And we also have to have dinner. And we also have to have fun. <sighs> it's a lot to do. <laughs> We're about to have a <laughs> ceremonial target candle lighting. The candle is bourbon pumpkin. And this is my roommate pan. What? This is the first time in my life I'm seeing one of those things. Oh, really? What? I got it from a YouTuber, actually. Like, they recommended it. It's gonna take a while. 2,000 years later. Work! Is this symbolic of our future? <laughs> <laughs> One ah! of us is gonna bright. <laughs> okay, there we go. Aww. Yay! Yay! Bourbon pumpkin moment. Do you wanna get the other one? Yeah. Um, I saw the bourbon pumpkin candle on KDU's vlog, and she was like, it just smells like, what did she say? Fall, fall. threw yeah. up. Fall, yeah. Fall, fall, fall vomit. <laughs> and I hadn't. Yeah, I hadn't smelled the candle before because Tan went to go get them from Target for us. Thanks, Tan! I was excited about this shelf for so long before I moved in because I had a vision for it. I don't know if this is exactly that vision, but I've always wanted to have like, 
you know, a place where my skincare and hair, like, products could be aesthetically displayed, and this is it. And my camera's having a really hard time focusing for some reason. The mirror's kind of dirty here. Um, I guess next time I will bring more and I can swap out, like, my lineup, you know? Woo! Okay, so remember how Venice and I were going to go to Home Depot to buy tools to disassemble the bed from Craigslist? Well... We did that, and then we went over to the seller's house. And when we got there, the bed looked like this. And I don't know if you can tell from the picture, but that shit does not look right. And the seller's daughter apparently built it herself, and she had one of the bed frame pieces upside down, which meant that all the slats were slanted. And, oh, also, the mattresses were stained with her period blood. Ew. So, anyway, it took us two hours to disassemble the bed, get it into my car, because the guy's apartment was literally the furthest unit from the elevator. And that is what went down with the bed. Okay. Oh. Wow. Dude, one wrong move and you're gonna be impaled on one of these. Yeah, no. Dowels. No, it can't move. Okay. Well, okay. I can move. That's the problem. I will. It's 9:42, and <gasps> we still <laughs> have to sneak this home up in the elevator. Probably gonna take us a lot of trips. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, Talon and James can maybe help. I don't know. Oh, hey, wait, no, there might not be a bathroom. Yeah. Do you want to sleep on the mattresses tonight? Yeah. And not move this? Let's just do the bed tomorrow. Do you care if this is chilling in your I, I don't care. Okay. That's a good proposition. Okay. Oh, got real dark real fast. Ah! Um, <laughs> okay, so originally the bed was 125. And he gave us 25 bucks off yes. the original 125 shit because back. he was like, sorry. Yeah, he was like, sorry, that that, that was way more like that. Work. Yeah, that should not have been like that. <laughs> Y'all, when we got there, I was just looking at Vinny's like, <laughs> because it didn't look right. Girl was the girl on the bed before she was yeah. slanted for like a year she was sleeping <laughs> slanted for a year and five dollars left over we're gonna get some tacos tacos that's our taco money now Denise, <laughs> i can't wait for you to try these <laughs> do you like it <laughs> What are we watching today? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that as pot holder. Bro, we're watching your name. Wow. It Mrs. looks fun. Mrs. Mr. Piggy? You can just call me Piggy. Mr. Piggy was my father. <laughs> Tan is making dog mandu cook for dinner. We just moved up the bed from the car. So it's right now. Hang on. 9.19 p.m. of the next day. All the pieces of the bed are now up in the apartment. Yay! Excited for the manduku and excited to see like the kitchen coming together too. We're just starting to like figure out where we want different things to go. Um, Tan used the dishwasher for the first time yesterday. <laughs> Were you impressed? Yes. I still was nervous, so I cleaned. <laughs> I still like cleaned it, not with soap. I just used the sponge yeah. to clean out things. Yeah, but still impressed. Typical people who don't who didn't grow up using the dishwasher are very suspicious and like, yeah, like just like skeptical. how can a machine? Yeah, be yeah. Happy. Like how can a machine clean dishes to my liking? How? Well, it's ready. Yay! Dinner's ready now.
a girl has bloody mattresses. It's okay though. I'm gonna cover them up and not not think about how bloody they are. How bloody they are. <laughs> oh my gosh! Look at this magic. Nothing's nailed down. I'm gonna fall Shh. through and be lost forever. Shh. <laughs> Should we do a haul video? Yeah. Okay. We wanted to do a haul because we went to the mall today. You want to explain what happened on the way to the mall? Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, so there was a, um, a bunch of clothes hanging on the outside of someone's gate and hedge. Um, and a sign that said, free costumes. Free costumes. costumes. What did we find but tons of... after me someone's <laughs> culture is not my costume but actually this is my culture that is her culture <laughs> I'm, i just took it before before a white person could yeah and we did see somebody walking away with one yeah. before us who was quite obviously not chinese <laughs> anyway a car the thing is <laughs> <laughs> So we're here to look at actually quite a few things. I need a dresser. A dresser? Um, that's like for me, that's like for me. Craft for common spaces in Australia. Um, maybe some hangers. And possibly, possibly, a kitchen table. Look out. I need slash table, tiny slash table. Here's to us finding everything we want. Maybe also some like lights. Yeah. Decorative lights for her. Yeah. Kind of go for like a hookah vibe in my bedroom. What's a hookah vibe? It's like a Danish word. Um, oh! Maybe like comfy, cozy. That's right, it's yes. spelled H-Y-G-G-E. Yes. I've never said that word out loud. Yeah. I would only know how to say it because I watch a lot of videos about it. <laughs> cool, we're going for that vibe in her room. Disneyland. I know. My first time. Hey. Wow. I think I spent a lot of time at Ikea as a child now. Mm. I'm starting to think I've been here too much. Uh, for you to be able to explain to me how yeah. everything works. <laughs> Honestly though, if I didn't know that, I definitely wouldn't have stopped to take photos of them first. Yeah. So let's go to H Mart. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of people. LA always crowded. We're also going to stop by Paris Baguette. It's so weird to say it like that. Fatty Baguette. <laughs> We're gonna go to Fatty Baguette right now because tomorrow is Tan's, ooh, Stain's, boyfriend's birthday. And we are going to look for a red velvet cake, the fitting of the occasion. Are you cake? Yeah. Oh, it's not red velvet? I don't think so. Oh, no. They might, they might have right now. 
my Crocs and some special Croc accessories. <laughs> Crocs! I got the platform kind. Oh yeah. Look at these. I know, they're so cute. The knees, they're cute. They're cute. Oh, did the knees not like that? The knees hates Crocs. This is the clincher though. This is what is gonna take these already pretty cool platform Crocs to the next level. Bad bunny gibbets. We're gonna put these in here. Ay, bendito. Bebody, baby. Oh, true.